guys, it's your boy Goku here with a special announcement for you all to see, so make sure to watch the entire video. Now, with that out of the way, let's jump into this. So, I have been wanting to do um, more full-blown reaction channels for the longest time, but I've always been sort of hesitant in doing it for obvious reasons, but my main reasons were I didn't want it to affect the flow of me doing regular reactions, um, of doing gameplay videos and other stuff that I do on the channel that you guys enjoy. So I went to my community tab, got your guys' input, and you guys all basically said you would support me no matter what I do. Um, I really like the comment of you guys saying that I should test the waters a bit, so I decided to go with that and to test the waters of me trying to do more full-blown reaction videos. Obviously they will be redirected, but the question was, what do I react to? You know, there were so many choices going in my head like, okay, what should I, should I react to this? Should I react to this? Uh, there were so many choices in my head, but I came up with five that really, that I was really okay with. You know, there were so many contenders, but these five are the ones that made the list. And I'm sorry if you guys, you know, had others in mind. Odds are I was thinking of those too. There were so many like Freakazoid, there was so many like Pinky and the Brain. Um, Ren and Stimpy, there was so many, like, Rugrats, Jimmy Neutron, Fairly Odd Parents, you know, the original, Spongebob, the original three seasons, and a few other seasons. There was just so many going in my head that I wanted to do, but I ultimately came with these five. So here are the five that you guys can go onto my community tab and vote for on what I will react to. The first up, obviously, is Teen Titans, the original Teen Titans, just so you guys don't get confused. It's the original Teen Titans from 2003, um, because when I'm going to my community tab now, you guys are just saying F Teen Titans Go and all this stuff, which, that's fine, but I just want to let you guys know this is the original Teen Titans. Um, this was a no-brainer for me because Teen Titans was one of those shows that I really grew up watching. I just, I just, I was so enamored with that show and just, it became such a part of my childhood. I just like, I would love to revisit and go back and rewatch. And what's interesting about me when I first watched Teen Titans, you know, I had watched Batman the Enemy series. I was just big on Robin, uh, Batman Beyond, and this show came out of the gate and it just offered me something so. It's really, it's animation style really is what really drew me in. And the style was so different than what I was used to. I was just so into this show and it was just so incredible. And the storylines, you know, were awesome. So. I picked Teen Titans, that's one of the uh, options for you guys to choose from. Um, so there you go, that's, there you go, Teen Titans. Uh, next up on the list is Kim Possible. Now Kim Possible was one in many, many other different, many other different TV shows that you guys could have picked from. Um, another one that was really close, that, that was in my mind, was The Proud Family. They were neck and neck, uh, along with Recess. Because those three shows were some of my best shows, that, or some of the best shows I watched on Disney, bar none. You know, That's So Raven was on there as well, but I was trying to really stick it to cartoons and not live action. So, um, yeah, uh, Kim Possible. Brandy and Mr. Whiskers was also on my list as well as, as well as Dave the Barbarian, because I felt those shows were incredibly underrated and didn't get, you know, the recognition it deserved. But if I was going just for a show that just had me... Every day, just watching every day, Proud Family, Recess, and Kim Possible were those shows that I just, I just had to go, whenever I got home from school, had to go sit down and watch, so those were the shows, um, so that's on the list, Kim Possible ultimately was the victor, and that's on the list, so if you guys want to vote for Kim Possible, it's on there. Another one was, I always felt that was so underrated, was Static Shock. Static Shock, I just liked right out of the gate. I uh, love Static's character. I, I just I fell in love with Virgil Hawkins, Dwayne McDuffie's style. Um, you know, Justice League and Justice League Unlimited were also contenders as well, but Static really stood out to me because, and I really and the funny thing about that, I really am upset that I never got that crossover between Static Shock and Teen Titans because there was actually plans for that and it just never happened. So. I always felt better about that. That's why I have them so close on the list because Static was just something I really enjoyed. It was a TV show that a lot of people don't even know about and a lot of people do know about but a, a good chunk of people don't know about and I really wanted to bring that to light and I felt it earned its place on the list. So Static Shock, if you want to vote for Static Shock, it's up there. 
Another one is by far um, my favorite Cartoon Network show of all time. There's so many great Cartoon Network shows that have existed on Cartoon Network, but this show is my favorite. If you ask me, this show will be my favorite. There's very shows, there's very, very few shows that I would put on the same level as this show, and that is Ed and Nitty. Um, that was bar none my favorite Cartoon Network show on Cartoon Network. The adventures of these guys, I related so much to these characters. Um, for different reasons that I don't want to go into, but I always enjoyed the misadventures of Ed, Ed, and Nettie, or Ed, Ed, and Double D, <laughs> however you want to call them. Their adventures were just amazing, how they always tried to scam and get jawbreakers. It, it was just awesome. And I really enjoyed the movie, too, which, by the way, was my transitioning into being a teenager at that time when that movie came out. So it was like the end of an era <laughs> when I saw that. So yeah, uh, Ed, Ed, and Nettie is on there. So if you guys want to go and vote, that is also on there. And last but not least, this one was tough because there was just quite a few, um, quite a few contenders. It was Batman the Animated Series, Spider-Man the Animated Series, X-Men the Animated Series. All three are great. And honestly, if you want my honest opinion, I was more of a Spider-Man fan um, than anything. Well, Batman too. Actually, Batman is my favorite DC and Spider-Man is my favorite Marvel. So I was really torn more between those two and X-Men was just awesome as well. And I thought it deserved to be at least in the conversation. But it really came down to Spider-Man and Batman. And the more I reviewed, the more I kind of just... I wanted to go with Spider-Man, I really did, because Spider-Man, I really enjoyed Spider-Man the Animated Series, but it had issues, and with Batman, Batman, every time I look back or I was watching a show, I actually, I actually decided by watching one episode on each side, and the more I watched Batman the Animated Series, the more I was just into it than I was with Spider-Man the Animated Series, looking back, even though I still enjoy Spider-Man the Animated Series, when I look back and watch the Batman Animated Series, it's just, it has something that just catches me, it just... Ah, oh, man, so I was like, oh, I hate to do this, but I have to go with Batman the Animated Series. I'm sorry, Spidey, you're always my favorite, though. Um, but yeah, Batman the Animated Series is on the poll, so you guys are more than welcome to go on and vote for that if you want. Um, I just wanted to um, promote it a bit because it's going to be up for a few days, and whoever wins, I will start doing some recordings for that. Like I said, we're going to test the waters a bit and see if you guys like it and depending on how well um that tv show does i might do more but i plan to react to just one episode um on whoever wins that poll and then depending on how well it does and how much more you want i'll do more um so thank you all for watching this video thank you for sticking around if you have go onto my community tab and vote for what you think i should react to um, voice, you know, and, and tell me why, guys. I would love your, your opinion on this, you know? You know, I would really love your insight on why you think that this show should, uh, be the show I react to. Because, um, Danny Phantom, I forgot to mention, Danny Phantom was one that I really strongly considered putting on there. Because originally it was going to be seven, um, shows. And Danny Phantom was another one I was going to put on there. But I, for some reason, I backed off. So I'm sorry for you guys who had Danny Phantom on the mind. Just letting you know that it was on my mind as well. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys want. Uh, you can also tell me in the comment section, but it's more easier for me to look at the votes if you go and go to my community tab and vote there. It's just a lot easier for me to look at this. And like I said, do not, you know, don't hesitate, guys. Let it be known. If you want Kim Possible win, you better do all you can to, you know, because sometimes, you know, I'll, I'll look at the comments and if they, and some, if a person can make a strong enough case on why I, they think I should react to this or what that show means to them, it could sometimes even overshadow the voting poll. You never know with me, you know, because sometimes a good speech, a good speech can really <laughs> inspire you, boy. So, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you can do me a favor, hit that thumbs up, like, and subscribe as always to support the channel, and get out there and vote! Your votes matter to me. It matters to me, guys. And your opinion matters to me as well. So, thank you all for watching. I will see you in the next video. I'm a bit sick, so sorry if my voice doesn't sound 100% correct. I'm a bit, I am sick um, when as I'm recording this, so I'm going to be slurring a bit of my words. 
So thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Alright, take care guys, and happy voting!